Hey guys, just quick, so today we're going to play Long Live the Queen. And it's an anime game where you... Oh, fuck me, the sound. Oh, the music. Oh, I'm getting dead it. We're almost home. Your room is just the way you left it. Ah. So we're playing as Elodie, and she's a crown princess, and she's cute. And this is King David Jocelyn. I know it's hard to leave your school and all your friends, but I've arranged the best possible tutors for every subject. You have to work hard this year to prepare yourself before your 15th birthday, but I know you can do it. You'll learn quickly, and you'll make a wonderful queen. It's what your mother would have wanted. This is not what mother would have wanted. She wouldn't have wanted to die and leave me. No, she wouldn't. But sometimes bad things happen. We have to pick up and carry on. All of Nova depends on us. On you. <sighs> I will be here to guide you until your coronation. But the decision you make are ultimately up to you. Come, your maids are waiting. Oh, it's so cute! Welcome to Long Live a Queen. If this is your first time playing, you should read the brief introduction on how the game works. Fuck that! What I do want to do is turn down the sounds because I'm really... Fuck me. Shit, that was loud as fuck. Holy shit. Okay, so we got our skills, we got our mood, we're gonna outfit, classes, log, and menu. So the base, the, the point of this game is we need to uh, play this game as a queen until we're 15. And anything can happen, we could die, we could have sex or whatever, but we should try to not do those things and make it until our 15th birthday. So these are my skills. Oh, fuck, that's a lot. <laughs> and this is my mood. I'm depressed because my mom just died. And I'm afraid because I'm a queen and I only have this uh, uniform and we can go to classes holy fuck that's a lot of classes um, we should go to uh, mm, military classes would be good but history is also good uh, you know what we're gonna try to handle with weapons and we're gonna handle conversations uh, we're gonna use pole arms because uh, they're fucking awesome and we're gonna try to you know public speaking or you know what uh, court manners would no public speaking would be good done you learn about a variety of long weapons from the quarterstaff to the spear to the halberd and glaive and you are too depressed to focus properly on this subject right now well fuck yourself What's all the noise outside? Who's here? Oh, it's my cousins and my aunt and uncle. Darling, we are so terribly sorry to hear about your mother, Fidelia. Thank you. You look well, niece. <laughs> my, my penis is hard. Hi, Lodi! Hi, Lodi. I haven't seen you in ages. Will you be staying long? Yep! Mommy said we'd be here all month! Maybe... Maybe we'll have some time to talk later. Oh, okay, I'm gonna fuck up my voice this episode because why not? Okay, so now we can go somewhere. We can go to the uh, walk in the gardens. We get plus one lonely and cheerful. Uh, play with uh, toys. Still lonely. Uh, minus one depressed. Plus one depressed. Uh, let's try to not be depressed. So we'll go attend service. You attend service in a castle grove, letting the peace of the ritual calm your heart. Stop! Oh, it's just too, too cute. Okay, we're we need to get everything on this line because you know we don't want to get angry. Uh, classes. We're gonna still go with pole arms. You know what? Maybe we should. Uh, with medicine. Let's recognize poison because I don't want people to be poisoning me because it means that they can kill me. You are too afraid to focus properly on this subject right now. Fuck! 
okay? The first treatment for most ingested poisons is to purge the stomach by forcing the victim to eat powdered charcoal, which can absorb dangerous substances. I didn't know this, so this is actually a pretty good thing. So if I ever get poisoned, I will fucking eat charcoal. What's... <laughs> What's the commotion outside, father? What's going on? Uh, which one was this? I have come to pay my respects in honor of your mother. You have no respect or honor. It's because of you and your powers that my wife is dead, you fucking whore. What? I am a lumen, as she was. And like every lumen, I'm willing to give my life, if necessary, to protect our domain. Your line has... Your line has been traitors for 200 years. I won't have you corrupting my daughter. What is for the crown princess to decide? Elodie, your mother trusted me, and I have much to teach you. Uh, yeah, let her stay. Fuck it. I want to hear what she has to say. She stays. As you wish. Fuck. Okay, so now we need to stop being scared. So, how do we... Yielding, is that good? But then we get depressed again. Fuck. Willful and angry, maybe that's a good thing. You sneak a peek at some of the lu luckless, luckless peasants held in the dungeons. Petty thieves and troublemakers now suffering in the dark. They're obviously bad people, but seeing them so miserable still feels unfair. There must be a better way. Okay, but why is... What's happening? She, oh, goddamn, she's gonna get depressed again. Fuck you. Stop being depressed. Come on. Stop. Stop it. Okay, uh... Still, we're gonna go with archery now. And still with poison, because I really need to... To, uh... Okay, you learn how to twist and wax bowstrings from a variety of fibers. Certain poisons will counteract each other, such that either on their own will kill the victim. Be careful, applying a matching amount of the other will cure. Okay! <clears throat> he loves me! He loves me not! Lottie! Oh well, yeah, Lottie! Uh, do you have a boyfriend? Not really! I just like to play with the flowers! <laughs> All of a sudden, the Duchess of Ursul rushes into the garden and points a sword at you. What the fuck? No, not at you. At your feet? Princess, don't move. Hold still. You want to hold still, but you don't have the composure to to hold your position without peeking. You look down where her sword is pointing. There's a snake in the grass! You can't help it. You squeak and jump back. The snake tenses and prepares to strike. No! Your cousin pushes you aside, and the snake fangs sink into her leg. Lobby! Too late. Juliana swings her swords and cut off the snake's head. What is going on, Adele? Your daughter's been bitten by a milk viper. They're poisonous. Get a herbalist right away. I will treat my daughter. I certainly can't trust anyone here to keep her safe. I'm sorry. I don't feel good. We'll be returning home to Mera immediately! <clears throat> Your aunt has a point. Milk vipers are not native to this area. That snake should never have been here. Someone may have tried to kill you. Will Charlotte be okay? I don't know. Okay, that's uh... Fuck this music is so fucking loud I can't even concentrate on which accents I'm trying to pull off. And no, my accents are suck! But this music makes it more suck. Fuck! God, suck. Okay, so now we're going to go in the gardens. We're lonely, but we're cheerful. Why do you keep looking so afraid? Stop being so afraid, dude. Um, we need public speaking, seriously. And we need... What's the royal demeanor? We need composure. No, fuck it. We need elegance. No, you know what? We need presence. Because we need to, you know, show that we are not afraid of shit. You practice tongue-twisting sequences of syllables to improve your enunciation. You're too afraid. Oh, suck my nuts. Suck my nuts with your you're too afraid, bitch. The castle seems quieter with Charlotte and Emery and Zara and their parents gone. It's certainly not empty, though. It seems like we get more servants every day. I was so worried about Charlotte after that snake bite her. But her mother fucking sucks, suck my nuts. Maybe she has a guardian angel. Oh, 
I, we need to stop being afraid. What's what's the opposite of being afraid? Uh, attend court. We could do that. Willful. Uh, I'm gonna talk to Ursul. What is what you wanted to teach me? First, I need to. If you have your mother's crystal, what crystal? The source of power for any lumen is a particular magical crystal. Once you've bonded with it, it becomes a part of you as long as you live. The royal crystal has been passed down from ruler to ruler for generations. It belongs to you. Now, except that the king may have been keeping it from you. Do you have a crystal? Of course. Whoa! She holds out her hands. Light flickers above her bl bl bosoms, bosoms, b b bosoms, and then, uh, with a shower of sparkles, something takes shape. Bosoms isn't that another word for tits? You reach out to touch it, and it dissolves away into nothing. Oh, it belongs to me. No one can take it from me until I die. You need to find the crystal that belongs to you. Okay, we're gonna find the crystal that belongs to me, I guess. And we need, uh, we need more presents, and we need more... No, we're, we're too afraid, so let's do athletics. We're gonna go running, and then we go military logistics, because why the fuck... No, no, fuck. We need more weapon handling. Uh, swords now. You are too afraid to FUCK YOU! You practice walking at a brisk but comfortable pace for a set length of, t of a time every day. Maybe I should do that in real life. One of the mates approaches you f for your attention. My lady, courtiers have arrived from the Duke of Sutna. We have Duke of Sutna? No, my lady. The, the Duchy of Sutna is in Tallahassee. They have brought you a letter and the gifts. Condolences. Of in the death of deeply regret, best wishes. Oh, what a beautiful necklace! <laughs> Fuck, I'm so dumb. This LED is so dumb. Something sparkly will make me feel better. <laughs> My character is so dumb. Uh. Mm. Talk to my father, I guess, because we need the. It's in a safe place. Can I have it? No. But it's mine! Meddling with magic killed your mother. I don't want that happen to you. Once you're crowned queen, I can't stop you from doing anything you want. But for now, you're still a child. Okay, wait, 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 wait. That's my dad. My mom was a queen and she died. Shouldn't he be taken over because he's still king? I don't get this game. How does it even, how do, how do monarch monarchies even work? I'm Dutch, I should know this. God, suck. Oh, I'm confident now. That's good. I'm so happy that I'm confident. That makes me happy. But still afraid. Fuck me. Uh, how do I make sure I'm not afraid anymore? <gasps> uh, we're gonna do some faith healing. Uh, no, uh, lore. Uh, no, no, you know what? We need to do, uh, medicine, battlefield medicine. Because let's say I get, uh, struck by lightning, uh, then I need to know how to deal with that shit. Uh, you take up a wooden sword and practice correct grips and stances. You learn that wounds, even minor ones, should be washed as soon as possible to prevent dirt from growing under the skin. I didn't know grow dirt could grow under the skin. I think they mean like infections and shit, and that's true. So, kids, if you ever ha get shot in the face, make sure you clean it first before you apply something to it. Although, if you get shot in the face, most likely is uh, that someone else has to clean that up for you because you'd probably be passed out or maybe even dead. But yeah, you never know. If you have a, if you have good defense, you know, you could take like six shots to the face, you know, probably nothing bad could happen on, uh, except for the fact that you're gonna die then. As you're walking, you spot a familiar figure in the palace gardens. It's the Duchess of Ursel. Maybe I should go and say hello. Then you notice that seated beside her is a woman in the robes of a priestess. They are very close together, the hands gently touching as they speak. Looks like she's busy. 
You turn and walk in a different direction, so as not to disturb them. At that moment, you notice something unusual. It looks like someone just left the palace grounds by going over the hedge. Was it a servant, a thief, or an assassin? Uh, I, I want to see. You look around for something to climb, but you're not sure if the nearby trees can support your weight. You run over to a statue and try to pull yourself up on the pedestal. But it's too awkward and you get on your feet in place. By this time, whoever you saw is probably gone away. Uh, Sneak out. You sneak out of the castle to have a little fun. You enjoy your freedom, but your father won't like it if he finds out. Well, he won't find out because I'm 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 awesome. And now we need to know about herbs, harmful plants, because I don't want to get poisoned as shit. Because okay, at least we can we we now know basics of poison, basics of battlefield medicine, but we need the basics of herbs. And we have trained all the weapons, so animal handling would actually be a good thing now. Uh, I'm a princess, so I will probably be working with a lot of horses. So I'll need to get my shit on that. So let's do some horse riding. You walk around the stables, meeting the royal horses, learning about their breeds and their names for different parts of, the, uh, of their autonomy. See? And now, you learn that willow bark can be used to relieve aches and fever. See? This is a game where everybody learns. You play, you learn, you hopefully not die. I didn't know anything about willow barks. Heck, I wouldn't even know what a willow tree is because they all look the same. If I see a tree, I just call it a tree. I don't call it a willow or a jew or a whatever. So it's all the same to me. But you know, now I know. As you are walking up the stairs, a maid comes running down holding a towering pile of linen. Before you can react, she barrels into you, sending you and the sheets flying. Oh my lady, I'm sorry! I could punish her. I could fucking kill her. I could, I could, I could decapitate her. I could send her in a dungeon where her family will never find out. Her family. She will never, never see her kids anymore. Never see her father. Never see her fucking friends. Her mom. Her sisters. <laughs> just, let's just say, no, it's okay. No, it's my fault. Oh, I'm not evil. I'm cute. If you say so, my lady. See, I'm not that evil. I, I should actually do a pre play playthrough. I would be like the most evil person in life. I could, uh, my father says I can't have the crystal until I'm queen, so we'll just have to wait. There may not be time to wait. The world is filled with dangers, and you'll need the powers of Lumen to fight them. You can't begin training until you've bonded with your crystal. Well, what else am I supposed to do about it? The crystal is probably held on the Garden Royal Treasury. You are the princess. You should be able to find a way inside. Otherwise, we might have to take drastic auction. Um, you know, I'll find a way. All right, I will try to get away into the treasury. I don't want people to die, but, you know. Uh, what's my mood? Okay, I'm still fucked. Uh, my skills. See, we're doing our skills. We're doing it good. We 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 are the goods. Um, uh, what is a good thing to train now? Uh, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. Uh, swimming, swimming is- oh, f oh, fuck, I busted my finger. Uh, swimming is a good thing to do. So, we go to agility, uh, that's- Oh, dance! That's a good thing! Because we're probably gonna dance, because we're like, um, what you call it? We're like, um, cool and shit. We're princesses swimming and dancing. You practice- Cure, curtsying, standing, and walking across the floor in a graceful manner. You get comfortable in the water, splashing around and holding your breath to go under. Okay. Oh, shit. Uh, save game, I guess. Sorry. Uh, we're gonna call it tits. Oh, no. You know what? Fuck it. Fuck. I'm just gonna call it fuck. It's much easier that way. Uh, There's a man here to see you. He wishes crown funding for a project of his. Remember. The treasury is not unlimited. If you choose to invest, you will have less money to work with later. 
Your Royal Highness, I have a plan to print books using metal letters which can be moved and reused. I need to borrow, I need to borrow 875 lassie to assemble the metal and factory to mold and cast the type. With this system, we will be able to create new books in a fraction of the time it takes now and make copies to send all over the world. I don't know much about factories or trade. Would it really be worth a while? We're not interested. What the fuck? I should have still had the choice. I would so have done it. Oh fuck, I'm dumb. I'm a dumb. Lodi, you're so oh you're dumb dumb. We need to we need we need to work on our intelligence. Visit the treasury. You try to walk past you do past the treasury guards, but despite your eyelashing, fluttering, food stamping, and outright threats, they won't budge. Hm. Uh fuck me. Uh we need stealth. Can we do stealth? Is there a stealth? Stealth one? Stealth? Stealth? Stealth voice? Yes, we need to uh, be able to sing because the why the fuck not? And now we need to military strategy. Oh, economics. That's a good thing. Uh, accounting. That's that's something we really need. But also production. So fuck it. We're gonna do production. See, this game is so is so good because you know you learn a lot of things. It's it's like you need to micromanage a lot of things. Okay, not micromanage, but you have to make you have choices. You know, and that's why I like this game. It's so weird. You practice deep breathing exercises to build up your ability to sustain a note. <sighs> Breathe through your stomach, your diaphragm, not your bosom. That's what I know from singing, but it's still I can't sing for shit. So I need to in real life. I need to level up my singing though. I will do that probably sometime. Never. Uh, you will. You are too willful to focus properly. How am I too willful? Fuck. I don't even know what willful means. Your Highness, my sympathies for your loss. Even after all these years, I sometimes forget that my own mother will never be coming back. Thank you. However, I must call for your aid. The Lixinian occupation of the country of, of the county of Imbrisumjum has gone on for too long. Now is the time to push back. I know there's a oh, fuck foreign affairs. I should have fucking do it on that. Oh. How can I run an empire if I don't know any shit anything about the empires around me? Oh. I don't know anything about the military. I don't want to fight. There must be a peaceful way to settle this. I will send for diplomats from Luxon and try to come to some arrangement. Thank you, your highness. Your highness, if I may ask, that necklace you're wearing, where did it come from? It was a gift from the Duke of Sedna. Then you have made arrangement with him? Um, what sort of arrangements? Your Highness, that is a courting gift. This man wishes to gain your hand in marriage. Oh, I didn't realize. Great, now we're getting married by some person that wants to have sex with us. Uh, we need to be not afraid. We need to... Oh, we need to be more yielding. Because I think willful is more like... I don't know what it means. Uh, so we can't... Do anything of uh, economics uh, because we're too willful. So let's go with athletics and no agility, reflexes. We need to quickly respond to things that catch fire and might kill us. And we're gonna do instruments. <clears throat> you tap out chiming diads on a glockenspiel, learning the basics of harmony and rhythm. What the fuck is a glockenspiel? Your teacher walks around you, prodding a finger at you, slowly in order to train you in blocking those touches without triggering fear or faster breathing. I should I should learn all these things in real life. The presence of Lixion is here. Be careful. No one wants to give up prizes that they have won. You have the full support of my sister and myself, your highness. <laughs> Let's get this over with! Your Highness... Oh wait. Your Highness, uh, thank you for granting me this audience. I'm sure we can come to an uh, unbreakable agreement. Let bygones be bygones, no? We will forget about your unprovoked attacks on us. 
and you will transfer the rights to this uh, little province. We can be good neighbors again without any lives being lost. Uh. <laughs> Execute him. <laughs> we could fuck him up. No, I don't want to start a war. Oh. We'll just offer him money. That's not acceptable. All land, all of the land north of the river belongs to us. We are willing to offer some payment in exchange for the inconvenience you have suffered, but nothing more. I believe we could settle that matter for 8,000 golden losses. That's an awful lot of money. 8,000. Uh, refuse. Fuck it. If you want to go to war with it, I'll do that. I don't think that will work. Oh, we're, we're just going to say the same. Excuse. Oh, fuck! You're trespassing on our lands. You will withdraw your troops at once. Only then we will have peace. Threaten to attack. Fucking hell. My soldiers are poised to destroy you. Withdraw now. Then I'm very sorry we are not able to come to an agreement. I guess now we have to fight. Great, I started the fucking war. Great job. Great. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, my nuts. Oh, I, I can't feel them anymore. I think my nuts are gone now. I'm nutless. Uh, we need more yielding. Sitting in on a court session is not fun at all, but it pleases your father, and it may be important for your future. Uh, what's, what's, what's up with your mood? Oh, she's fucked up depressed. Fuck me. Uh, we're gonna... Uh, now we're gonna do economics and accounting. And... Uh, archery because we need to shoot those bastards in the face. Uh, you learn to cut, fletch, and tie arrows. And you brush up on basics mathematics with the help of an akabakabakabakas. I don't even know what an akabakabakabakas is. So, you see report on the outcome of the battle against the Lexoniats. You succeeded in driving them out of Marie, but it cost you almost a full battalion of soldiers and a great deal of mat material. You lost a th Whoa, I lost a thousand soldiers. Fuck. The Duke of Marie will be happy, but we could have done better. You also receive a letter informing you that Telerus, Duke of Sedna, will be arriving for an official visit next week. Uh, um, I need to be less depressed, so this is the only... Cheerful is also good for not being depressed, so... Uh... <laughs> I'm just gonna do this. It's gonna play it safe. Stop being so sad. Don't be the sads. We need more military, uh... We need more military logistics also. Fuck! This game is so... It's so... Ooh, it's so penis -y. Uh, we need to uh, handle dogs too. Because what if a dog comes at me and tries to eat my face? You visit the kennels and learn about the different breeds of dogs. You learn about the types and amounts of food required for an army on the march, and how long they will remain edible. Ah, oh, your highness! What a pleasure it is to meet you in person at last! Your description did not do you justice! I don't know how to deal with hands, older men. Pay me compliments. I was so pleased to hear that you have accepted my humble proffering, Jill for Jill. But you are the most precious. I hope that this is only the beginning of a mutual beneficial relationship with Texas. <laughs> he really does want to marry me. Uh, accept his offer. We're gonna marry him. I would be honored. Elodie! Your grace. Are you not aware that my daughter has only 14 summers? It's my decision! A buff for the only, of course. There's no need for hurry. You have your coronation to plan for, after all. It might be a service in any way. Please send for me. I'll be happy to offer my protection or advice. I'm spitting my 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 thingy. Well, at least we're gonna marry a guy now. We're only 14. It's not like a total big ass pedophile or something. That's. Uh... Yes! Okay, now look good. Yes, this this looks like a good balance. So now, finally we can do economics and production. I know, this is so gay. E economics, who does that? Me. 
Come on, I need to do this. Decoration. Nah, fuck it, we're gonna play instruments now. You learn to play notes and skills on a simple wooden recorder. And you're too willful to suck a dick. Fuck. Your request... You are requested to stand in judgment. A woman has been convicted of attempted murder and requests the mercy of the crown. Your Highness, the slatherin dares to beg pardon when she admits that she tried to poison my sister under her own roof. Which sister? Curie Sande, the Duchess of Me. Jesus Christ, those names. Guys, I know you like using your fantasy and shit. But dude, the names, dudes. Names, 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 dude. Is she all right? She is unarmed, and we caught the culprit in the kitchens before. Could eat anything in her false pill. Well, what do you have to say for yourself? It's just as it is. Them devils tried me, brother, and broke me, mom's heart. Lie to her, they did! When she wanted to see why he'd not come back, she he'd gone for a soldier, when he never would! He weren't the only one he them! I waited ten years for my chaster and my own back! Now it's Jesus! I don't know what the fuck is going on. You see, it's completely on breast hanger and be done with it. I don't know. Um, Impersoner. You tried to murder a noble of my domain, and I have no reason to believe you wouldn't do it again. You'll be imprisoned for the rest of your life. You'll not have me! All of a sudden, she breaks loose from her guards and rushes at you. Oh, fuck. In your court stress, you are unarmed. You grope for a weapon, and you find only a heavy golden ornament, which you hurl in her direction. Shit! Your missile flies wide of its mark. Before you have a chance to do anything else, your personal guards step into action, cutting the woman down before she can endanger you. Her lifeless body lies bleeding on your carpet. Clean that shit up! Holy shit! And on that note, I'm gonna end this episode here. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to see more, just leave a comment and I'll do more because I actually enjoy this video game. Yes! Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like and leave a share. You can also subscribe. Anyways, guys, just quick signing out! I really love you guys. Are you not happy?